hi everyone welcome to this demo video of inventory post notification so the purpose of this module is to send automatic messages to several users that you already set in the configuration menu regardless it's a simple send messages in chatter or a to do message so before we begin now let's see the um, apps menu here and we go to inventory and make sure that this inventory notification here is already installed and later on in this scenario i have three windows here uh, this one is for the administrator privileges and the two another two is a uh, user called Bennett and here is Joe so the demonstration here is to send the messages from the uh, change change um, master product to both user here and before we begin that uh, demonstration uh, you need to make sure that both of this user here already set the um, preferences here and set the notification to handle in Oju and make sure the email is already set because we want this interaction to be set internally in our system here same goes with Joe here let's see we need to configure this uh, notification and email and since we already already set let's go back to our um, administrator account here let's see if we go to the uh, settings go to inventory general settings here and we scroll down until we find the inventory notification here so we need to check this activate inventory notification and if we scroll down we have several configuration here and it says a uh, sales price notification barcode notification product name and also the product archive so this configuration will help you to send auto messages once the master product has a recent changes so let's demonstrate it with this um, sales price notification here check this and in notification we want to send a basic uh, auto chatter send messages here and we want to push this to Bennett and Joe with this uh, message here so as we can see here we have a placeholder that says dear user the price of product has changed to new sales price so um, I will tell you about this um, soon but for now let's use uh, the default as the placeholder says here and we can click save now um, we can go to our master product here in inventory menu we have a grapes here and we would like to uh, change the sales price let's say we want to change the sales price to 4000 and we see we don't have any um, notification here um, and we, all, we, we don't uh, track anything here yet and now if we change this to let's say 4000 here and if we save that we see we the system are sending the um, messages to Joe and Bennett and the recent change are done by administrator here so if you have uh, your user it will appear here if you change that uh, product it's based the, the, the sender of the message is based on who are changing the certain fields in this inventory product here so now if we go to the user account we have been here we have one um, notification here that says dear Bennett the price of grape has increased to 4,000 here and same goes with Joe uh, we can also see the notification in this cast menu here we can see there are um, new messages here can just reply from here or uh, check this mark as a read 
in this case we done that and also for planet 2 and now if we want to set the message to uh to do message we can head back to the administrator account and we can change this notification type to uh from send messages to to do and now you can see that we have this um deadline here deadline is also same as a uh, due date and here we have a field number here and uh, if we fill it with two let's say this means that the deadline or the due date is two days from today on so now uh, for this demonstration I want to put this as one and here in the message title here let's make it same with the uh, message itself with the several uh, things that I will tell you later here and now we can save and let's head back to our grapes here we want to change this price um, to let's say to uh, 1000 we want to decrease the price to 1000 here now we can see that um, we have uh, messages here that um, says dear Bennett the price of grapes has decreased to 1000 we can see that there's a difference here in decrease and increase message here and this called a uh, prefix and what I mean by prefix is that it's a dynamic uh, string that later can be seen or can be set by in, uh, inputting this bracket here something like this if you, and if you want to see what kind of prefix that supported uh, you can head back to the uh, module description as the first video goes here you can go scroll down and you will find the uh, corresponding sales price or product name which is uh, support to their own uh, field in the settings menu here and then if we go back to this user we now see the um, notification here in today because it's 12 in the morning now for this record and if you see here we have a notification for Bennett and we also can see for Joe that we have a to do for both of them to do things here um, that's it for now uh, I hope this module helpful for you and if you find this module helpful um, you can get it in the Odoo official store and if you want some uh, customization uh, you can also contact me and if you want to do that you can see my email in the bottom of the module description here thanks for watching